Hey guys, what's going on? It's the and welcome back to another video on the channel, guys. Today I'm going to show you guys how to get Moltres and Pokemon Break Bronze, guys. For this thing, you need three different items slash Pokemon. So let's get right into what you need. So... You need a Pokemon that has Compound Eyes, and you need a Pokemon that has Frisk Y. I will explain to you right now. You need to get an item, guys, that is called a Deep Sea Skill. So, be sure to check in your PC, guys, if you maybe have a Pokemon that already holds one of those. Will be, uh, like, will be really, really useful, because you have to get three in total for all the three the birds. But you just need one for Moltres if you just want to get him. So, what does Compound Eyes do? Does actually increase the drop chance from, the, from 5% to 20% if you want to get a Deep Sea, sea Skill from scratch. And as well, the Frisk ability actually will wet, let you know if you actually, if the Pokemon that you encounter has a item on them. So, what I would recommend you to hunt for these deep sea skills are going to be Chin Chows. They are located in the Kraganos Mines. You will go in there, down there, and go to the area where you would normally go sail to the Lepros. You don't sail, but you're just going to use your good rod on the sea over there. There's a 17% chance for you to encounter a Chin Chow. So that's gonna be pretty, pretty easy. So once you encounter Chin Chow, you have your Pokemon with the compound eyes on the first slot, because it only works if it is in first slot. Uh, then it has a 20% chance to actually hold the skill. You switch to the Noibad, and then it will say if it has a skill or not. If it doesn't, you run away for the Chin Chow. If it does, you catch your Chin Chow. And you have one of your three skills you need for all the birds. So once you get their skill, you're gonna go to this building over here. I'm gonna buy a map. Just have to give it Talk to this guy over here and I'll show you guys which map you actually have to get because I already bought all three of them so I'll just say, tell you the name you need to have because if you want a specific one you have to get the ride map guys but of course you can buy all three of them if you want all the three legendary birds how to get all the legendary birds but they're all on the channel guys go check them out if you haven't done it yet so let's go over here you need to go to Obsidia Island for a mulch so let's go all aboard and check this bad boy out so hello beautiful cavern how are you doing so let's go check out mulches guys uh, as well, there should be a TM here somewhere. I've not checked it out yet. I've, I've, uh, this is the only... Ooh, a Turkinator. Uh, Turtonator, sorry. I've not actually uh, seen this cave yet. Looks really cool, though, the background. We already have Art, Kino, and Zeb, those guys. Like I said, be sure to check them out on the channel. Oh, we already see Moltres flapping in the distance over there. That's pretty sick. Let me actually see if I can uh, spot the TM slash HM somewhere over here. Because I set the locations for the other ones in the video. But I don't see it right now. So maybe it's in like a sneaky location somewhere. Um, so we have to be... Keep, I'm keeping my eye out for the Pokeball. It's not like it's not, it's not really that hard to find normally. So it should be fine. Let's just see where we have to go up to go get Moltres. I think it's over here maybe somewhere. Let's see. So let's go over here. I'm going to continue along the way over here. Just grab a ball. Just go on our hoverboard, guys. Go on our hoverboard. And go up over here. And we're going to go to Moltres, guys. Let's go get another repel. This is actually one of the longer routes, I think, that it takes to go to one of the legendaries. But it looks pretty sick, guys. Oh, my God. Look at Moltres. He looks so cool. Let me quickly get a free screenshot. I think he looks uh, the worst out of the three, to be honest, with the particles. Uh, like, it, it looks kind of weird for you guys, probably, but this guy needs to stop talking, because then I can take my screenshot, because I can just edit the people out. But I, this, the text stays so long. Come on, text. There we go. Uh, Aaron, getting you, and I want my screenshot like that. It looks pretty sick, and press screenshot. I'll just grab another one. There we go. Just for the wings. But let's go encounter this guy. I always like to save up, guys. Always save, just in case if you maybe want to get a shiny or whatever, guys. But it's going to be Moltres. How are you going to look, bad boy? Hello. Ooh, the portals actually look really good in the sprites over here. Maybe a little bit too see-through. I cannot really see him in the background. Um... I don't know if that's because of the, the like the lava in the background or it's because of the sprite. I don't really know. I don't really, it doesn't really matter though. Like we're gonna use our master ball. We're gonna grab them up. Ooh, that's actually a really high master ball catch. I don't know what happened over there. But it's fine. I'll take it. I'll take it. Maybe the sprite's just really high up. Uh, no, I think I think it's the lava because it does the particles on the Pokeball as well. Makes it look weird, but it's fine. We got a multi guys. Literally, we got some super good legendaries. So let's go check out what the stats are. Because if you if you look at this, guys, look at our set and everything. 31, 31, 31, 27, really, like, pretty good nature as well. Our Articuno has a pretty bad, uh, like, it's an okay nature, but look at the IVs. 31, 31, 31, 31, 31. So we, if we could pull off a perfect nature, 31 IV, one over here. This is actually pretty fine. I like the defense increase. Is it going to be 31 everything? 31, 31, 31 over there as well, but it's fine. It's, oh, these ones should have been switched around, but it's a pretty decent one as well. I'm not the biggest fan of the Moltres, but it could be a cool one. Flamethrower, Air Slash, and Ancient Power. That's a pretty cool little moveset as well. 
I like that mulch is looking smexy. So let's go check him out, guys. How does he look in game? Let's go uh, to just make our repel run out. Would be the best way to do it. Let me, in the meanwhile, search this uh, TM. Because I wonder where it is. I wonder where uh, they put it in the game. I think it's like on this side. Because you want to go up over here. I don't want to use another repel, guys. There we go. Get a Pokemon in here. A Slugma. Hello, buddy. How you doing? Let's go, Moltres. How are you going to look? Ooh, you actually look pretty sick from the backside as well. That looks pretty, pretty cool. Let's go check him out, guys. Let's use some Ancient Power. This is going to be the attack. Boom. Super effective on that bad boy as well. There we go. Moltres is doing the job. That's what we like to see. But guys, that is going to be how you get Moltres in Pokemon and Brick Bronze. Guys, if you want to know how to get all the other legendary bears, be sure to check out the video on the channel. The outsides look sick. I don't think there was anything on these outside, but it's fine. If you guys find anything, be sure to let me know on Twitter, guys, at the file official. But guys, that's going to be how you get Moltres in Pokemon Break Bronze. If you want to see all the other birds as well, be sure to check out the channel. And if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that beautiful subscribe button down below. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed this video. Because they always take a lot of time and effort to make for you guys every single time. So guys, thanks so much for tuning in today. I'll see you tomorrow for a new video. Take care, love you, bye-bye, and thanks so much for watching.